Hi guys, Matt from Checka Cola here. Today I just want to talk about the difference between public speaking and YouTube. Okay, so basically when you public speak, you get up in front of people and you you write a speech or you pre present your project or something like that with a live audience, which many people, including me, seem to be scared of. Which, I don't know why, but five minutes before the speech, the project presentation I'm calm you know two minutes before I'm probably calm a minute before you know I'm getting antsy and right before you get up there you know you start getting that thing in your heart you start getting nervous and which will cause you to stutter and stuff like that you know which affects your credibility on the subject and everything whereas opposed to YouTube you actually you post a video and many people can watch it. Actually, if you're really good at posting it, like the guys who are partnered, hundreds of thousands of people can watch videos. Like this one video, I actually did a video response for, and he picked my question for the video, and 250,000 people watched that video. So, like, if I got in front of a room and talked in front of 250,000 people, I'd probably pass out or die or have a heart attack. I'd be so nervous. But, anyways on the YouTube like 250,000 people watch that video like of me in it and him talking about the thing I told him to talk about you know but really you don't really feel like 250,000 people watch you just think like you and like a couple other people watch it but when you look at the view counter that's how many people watched it so it's like why when you get up in front of a room do you get so nervous but you can go on YouTube and post videos like write your stuff out and just present yourself and you're not you're not even scared so basically that's just what I wanted to talk about like I know like when you when I write a presentation or something when I'm practicing for it it'll be right on time you know if it's a five minute presentation I'll have five minutes right on time when I'm practicing out but when you go up to the podium and you actually get to it you end up either taking longer because you're scared and you're stuttering and you have to take some deep breaths and talk slower or else you end up taking like half the time because you go fast you forget stuff and and basically you just lose all your credibility and the people in the audience you know once you show you're nervous and the people can feel you're nervous they usually don't even listen to you anymore which makes it even worse if you're standing up there you know the people they're just looking at you and they're like looking at their watch and they want it to be over so when that happens that's a, you just end up going really fast and skipping points you know but on YouTube like YouTube is a I'd say practice for a presentation because on YouTube you can actually do it yourself and post it and then hundreds of thousands of people can watch it but you actually don't get scared because it's like they're not in the room with you. You're not trying to impress everyone. If someone likes your video, you know, they'll like it. But if they hate it, they put a thumbs down and they write a comment to you. But as opposed to live presentation, I would say that I'd rather get a 100, 100 hate comments and dislikes than one person in a crowd of about 20 or 30 to just give you that look like, what are you doing up there? You don't know what you're talking about. So anyways, that's just my views on how YouTube, like, it lets people express themselves and you guys like this video. I got other videos and like, I'm just starting out on commentating so I know I'm not that good. Like, if you guys could help out, you know, I could, I could tell stories and stuff, but it's, it's hard to make it on YouTube these days with all these partners. Like, you know, guys make a new channel and they get 10,000 subscribers with no videos and people who put hard work into their videos get zero subscribers maybe like 20 30 views because they're not well known and they're not bumping so basically that's what I, all I wanted to talk to you guys today and if you guys wanna put your views on public speaking that'd be great you know tell me the differences what you see between YouTube and public speaking and if you guys enjoyed this video like it if you didn't well thumbs it down and give me a couple comments that I can help I can help and thanks you guys for watching. Have a nice